Hi, my name is Mario Paniccia. I'm the CEO and co-founder of a company called Anello Photonics. We're located out in Silicon Valley. And what we've done is we've created the world's smallest optical gyro, which we call SciFog. Silicon Photonics Optical Gyro. Fits in the palm of your hand. It's basically the same concept as a fiber gyro, but based on integrated silicon photonics. So we've taken the concept of discrete components. This is something right here. This is a, a 3D print of a fiber optic gyro that today is the state of the art. Big, bulky, expensive, but it works really good. You have other gyros in your phone that are MEMS based. We've created the same concept of the performance of a fiber gyro, but at an integrated chip solution. So this is small form factor, fits in the palm of your hand, yet high precision. Not susceptible to temperature, not susceptible to vibration, not susceptible to EMI. Why is it useful? So now you have a gyro, gyro measures rotation. I put that into a system, and this is a system for land vehicles. So I have one optical gyro for heading, and the land vehicles, the heading is the key. Two GPS chips, this is a sealed unit, salt spray, we're shipping this into construction agriculture companies. So if I'm driving and I lose GPS, what do you do? We have a high precision gyro, you can rely on the gyro. If the signal starts going down, we have an algorithm that says rely more on the gyro, weight that algorithm. If I completely lose GPS, it's 100% the gyro. The other thing we can do is spoofing. If I'm driving and I look like I have GPS, but I check what does GPS say relative to my system. My system says I went 100 meter forward. GPS says I'm in Texas. Hey, something's wrong, rely on the gyro. To give you a sense of performance, we're doing like 100 kilometers of driving continuously, no GPS, less than a 100 meter error. 0.1% distance traveled for land vehicles. So this is our GNSS. If I get rid of the GPS, this is, we call an IMU plus, this is for indoor robots, things that drive in navigation. Same thing, it's a hardened unit, we're shipping this into construction companies, robots that, that print on the ground. Lastly, and this is the cool one, I take three Cyfogs, put them in a cube, put them together. Each one of these Cyfogs have an optical gyro, has accelerometers, and triple redundant MEMS. Now look at this. I have the equivalent of a fiber gyro, IMU, inertial measurement unit, to the state of the art. Look what we've done. This is the same performance, fifth to size, fifth to weight, fourth to power, more importantly, small lightweight, and what do we do? Now you can put this on a drone because of the size. And the way drones fly, everyone relies, everything relies on GPS. So a drone flies, what happens? It loses GPS, it doesn't know what to do. It, does it, it basically can't return to home, it sits there, hovers, or sometimes default, it crashes, or it defaults down. So what we've done is we've modified the algorithm, we've been working with the cube here, and Pixhawk, and we basically say, hey, you lost GPS, or you're losing GPS, don't worry, rely on the gyro. So now we can fly through jammed or contested regions without GPS because of the precision of the Anello technology. So this allows us to open up opportunities for GPS contested, GPS denied environments where you can fly through jammed regions. Here we're doing 10 to 15 kilometers, no GPS of flying, and a drone with similar 100 meter error. It's unheard of, right? And now what we're doing is we continue to optimize the algorithms. You have to take into account the wind, the speed. Lastly, so I talk about land, air, what's the last place? Big thing in maritime, above water. So what happens in the water, it's even the same thing. You look around, LiDAR doesn't help you, cameras don't help you, the water law looks the same. How do you navigate if you lose GPS? So we take the same system, we just tested last week with the Navy out in um, Newport, Rhode Island. Look at our website, Anello Photonics, go to our LinkedIn site. And we basically did a demonstration now these are boats that are moving two or three knots, maybe five knots, and now you have the waves. So now you have three, again, three dimensions, and we're showing that we've operated in GPS, we did with the Navy squares, where we manually turn on and off the, the GPS. We've tested our systems in a real GPS jamming and spoofing, can't be jammed, can't be spoofed. So we've created with this new technology, all based on the SciFog, Right, the world's smallest optical gyro, full IMU, full INS systems that allow you, as the thing says, we can now navigate in GPS denied or contested environments. And that's what we do. So any questions, any opportunities, contact us at Anello. We'd love to solve your problems.